Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to our YouTube channel another time. The topic tonight is Be Prepared. Be Prepared. Meaning of being prepared is to ready to do or to deal with something. Ready to do or to deal with something. In life, we prepare for several different situations that we expect to happen. Some simple, some complex. We prepare for simple things like preparing our kids to go to bed at night, making sure that they brush their teeth, making sure that they have the correct nightwear, to go to bed. We prepare also for more complex things like we prepare for our retirement. Am I going to have enough money when I retire? Is my pension going to be sufficient? Do I have enough family members around me when I retire to help if I need help? A long time is also spent on preparing for our kids' education and ultimate graduation. This one can be very expensive, so more time is spent on preparing for this one. Most young people, most young men and women prepare themselves at some point in time to get married and have children and a home and an education and live happily ever after. We also prepare for our vacations. We put away money to prepare for that time. You know, we can rent a nice hotel, we can rent a nice car and take the whole family and everybody have a good time. But I'd like to ask us a question. And the question I'd like to ask today is, am I preparing myself to meet God? Am I preparing myself to meet God? Luke 21 and verse 36 says, But stay awake at all times, praying that you may have strength to escape all these things that are going to take place and to stand before the Son of Man and to stand before the Son of Man. Listen to the chorus of this song. Careless soul, oh heed the warning, for your life will soon be gone. O thou sad to face the judgment, unprepared to meet thy God. Why so thoughtless are you standing while the fleeting years go by and your life is spent in folly? Oh, prepare to meet thy God. Be prepared. Tonight, we prepare for all of these things. We make preparation provisions for all the above that we mentioned, but very little time is spent on preparing our soul to meet God. Tonight, I want to remind us, as the scriptures says earlier, these things that are going to take place, what thing? There are so many things that are happening today. We have the coronavirus, we have Omicron, we have the Delta, we still have cancer around, we have crime in some country. Some countries are getting ready to fight each other over oil, some are getting ready to fight each other over land, all of these things are going on. But the Bible went on to say, these things 
shall all going to take place and to stand before the son of man so these things will take place but we are also be required going to be required to stand before God tonight I want to ask a question are we prepared to meet God the songwriter says oh Lord prepare me to be a sanctuary pure and holy tried and truth with thanksgiving I'll be a living sanctuary for you this is what we should aspire to be vessels for Christ we should aspire to giving Christ our heart and ultimately preparing ourselves not like the five foolish virgins we must prepare ourselves to meet God Almighty let's pray Lord Jesus your words have come to us and bless our heart it challenged our hearts oh God that we must be prepared to meet you and so Lord God help us to put ourselves in a place that we can hear your voice and when we do hear your voice we surrender Lord said here am I send me send me and so God I pray for all those who are listening to this or watching this oh God on YouTube that they may look into their lives and ask themselves the question am I being prepared am I preparing myself to meet Almighty God and so Lord Jesus on your return we will be ready we give you thanks we bless your name in Jesus name Amen thank you next time